Now to a big break in a violent follow home robbery in downtown LA last fall. Police made an arrest and ended up with a suspect, a stash of guns, cash, and even drugs. KKL 9's Jeff Nguyen is live in downtown LA with new video of that robbery and an update on the investigation, Jeff. Well, Juan, that newly released video shows a businessman being tailed and then robbed as he was heading to his office. And now the LAPD is announcing a major break in this case. This man was outnumbered and outpowered last October when the LAPD says four men robbed him of more than $600,000 worth of his belongings that he was carrying and in his car. It's scary, man. Hector Lujan was working in the back of a nearby warehouse when he heard the commotion on the 1100 block of East Pico Boulevard. Investigators say the suspects jumped out of a white four-door Maserati Ghibli. They must have targeted him from far. It's like, or there's someone they, they need. Right. The LAPD says at least one robber had a gun which he pointed at the victim's head, who's a business owner in LA's fashion district. On Wednesday, the recently formed Follow Home Task Force arrested 25 year old Cheyenne Hale as one of the suspects in the case. Detectives served a search warrant at a home where they recovered seven guns, 21 grand in cash, and a stash of drugs. There's another one. Wow. This comes after a major break this week in this armed robbery from January that was captured on cell phone video. These three men were arrested in connection with a series of robberies. Back at the fashion district, detectives hope someone will step up with information that will lead to more arrests in this violent case. Kent Cho, who works in the area, would like to see the same. Sometime we need to protect in my property, but it's not my problem. Everybody problem. And detectives say they have seen a number of Maseratis being used in some recent follow home robberies, but it is unclear if the white one in this case is connected to any other. We are live in downtown Los Angeles. Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News. Thank you.